Okay, next question, Gav. Where to position myself when I'm not on the ball, um, especially immediately after a missed shot or riding off? Okay, so interesting question, really, because for me, um, let's take immediately after I've missed the ball. Because what everybody wants to do the minute they've missed the ball is check and turn. Instead of look around to see what's happening behind before I decide what to do. Because so often you check because you've missed the ball and your player's coming behind and hits the pass past you and the opposition get it because you checked. 100% happens all so the time. My first thing is the minute I go over the ball, the second I go over the ball, I want to look behind and know what's happening. But I'm also, the second I go over the ball and miss the ball, my first thought is, where's the man I'm marking? Because if it's opposition, I need to do that. If it's my own player with the ball, very often if I can beat him, and we talk about videos such as mark and attack and that kind of stuff which we put out there, um, you know, if I can beat that man, I know I've got him under control. The pass comes, I've got the ball. If it's opposition that have got the ball, I know if I've got a turn, I'm turning with a man. If it's them hitting the ball over my head, I've already beaten a man. So it yeah. always goes back to that man-line ball principle all the time. 